Good morning, everyone. How's it going? Welcome back to the 8 Bits Terror Channel. And welcome back to Tomb Raider 3. We are on the third one. I'm so excited. I'm trying to figure out why my top looks gray. My, uh, my color away is all off. My video settings must be off. I swear this top is more blue. I must have changed something and it's gone weird. Um, hi. Hi, everyone. Uh, let's see. Who do we have with us? First in the chat is Travis Stamper. Look, there's wherever it is. Here-ish. There's your name. There's your name. First in the chat trophy. And who fan the eternal loser? Second in the chat. I'm sorry. I'm kidding. Second in the chat is the who fan. Spornicus Rex is number three. Doc755, hello, hello. Um, anyone else? Nightbot's not even on the clock yet today. Come on, Nightbot. Wakey, wakey. Wakey, wakey. How's it going, everyone? Hope the real 8-bit is feeling better. The real 8-bit is indeed feeling better. Um, he actually was feeling better by about 10 o'clock yesterday morning. Um, but he definitely needed to, like, sleep in and, uh, and just hang out at home. Uh, but yeah, he's feeling a lot better. Thank you for asking. Um, hopefully Travis isn't usurped again. I know, right? Travis, I think you missed that yesterday. You were first in the chat and our little mini, um, the stream went, went weird. Was it yesterday? Sorry, maybe in the day before where the stream went weird for a second and we had to restart. And, uh, yeah, you didn't get back in time. Jair Bear took your spot. All right, guys, uh, let's get into it. Let's play. Some video games. Let's play some video games. How do you guys like this gif? <laughs> All right. Woo, temple runes. Oh god, we're swimming. Why, why did I save it underwater? What the fuck is wrong with me? Oh, okay. I obviously didn't save it. So we almost got killed in here. There we go. All right, I have no idea where we're going already. I'm just like, what? I see a ladder up there, maybe. Oh. Don't want to get crushed by any more falling rocks. That was not pleasant. Being squished whilst underwater and then drowning. My schedule is wrong. Oh, yeah, I need to change it to Tomb Raider 3. Yeah. Yesterday, I would have done all that sort of stuff yesterday. Um, but with little Forbit being off, off from school, I got nothing done. Nothing at all. Oh, I see a snake. Snake. <laughs> the schedule says two. Claire sits upon a throne of lies. Oh, yep. 
It's all propaganda. Welcome to the dictatorship. We've never been at war with Eurasia. We've always been at war with Eurasia. Eurasia? Oceana? Both? Either? Um, where are we going? This way or this way? Yeah, you know, like that way we're going to hit our head. This way there's that weird little cutout, which we may be able to sail through. Let's give it a save. 64 saves and we're only on level 2. Can you fucking believe it? Now I've said this, I'm not convinced we can go this way. Nope. Had a feeling. Had a feeling it wasn't going to be quite... Uh, quite reachable. Melissa, hello. Uh, you'll be at home the majority of the time today. It's most of the kids I work with are on telehealth. Oh, nice. Nice, leisurely, not really, but kind of day at home. At least you... Don't have to go into the office, I'm guessing. Um, this is gonna suck. That's gonna suck pretty fucking hard. Oh, okay, let's shotgun this. We killed him. And he didn't poison us. Yes. And how do we get in there? feeling there's going to be a boulder. It felt like a boulder sort of situation. God damn it. Oh, Lord. These Indians, whoever it was who built this place, were, they were serious. <laughs> penitent man, penitent man, penitent, penitent. I love that you can crawl in this. Does this feel like a trap? <laughs> Lara had to run before she could crawl. Uh, um, you were supposed to have, Melissa, three evaluations this week, all of them cancelled. Two kids, you need to go into the office or daycare to see, I don't mind, and make my own schedule. Oh, nice. Okay, I feel like this is where a secret is. Huh. OK, 
guess we have a path forward, but I'm going to do some more investigating. I, I'm, my spidey senses are sensing something. Yeah, I can see something through the gap there. Scheduling is hard. It's like pay playing Tetris, but with no prize at the end. Or waiting to hear back from five different people for one open slot. That must be annoying. I'll leave her here. What's this do? Opened a door in a room I don't remember. Yay! Oh, is there anything else? Hang on. Got wrong. Hmm. 
She is going to be sore tomorrow. boxed in. Ah, that doesn't work. Um... Shit. I want to get on the other side of this spot. I don't know if that's possible. I don't know if there's anything there, but I just, I really want to... I know we were coming up on a secret and I really want to just find it need to do oh yeah She's gonna have to soak in a giant ass sink for hours. <laughs> yeah. Or Winston. You're gonna have to help get her in there. All right, let's see if that was worth any of that effort. No, it was not. There's nothing there. What? Oh, wait, hold up. Is that a boulder? Hold, hold up. Let me, let me save after all of that. Forty-eight flares. Oh yeah. Oh, that is one big set of balls. Boulders. I'm gonna pick left. We survive. Oh, the spikes down there. Steep. <coughs> oh, excuse me. <laughs> Stream is not safe for work. God, it'd be really nice if we could be done with all of these traps. Oh, no, never mind. Uh, is that... No, wrong button. Water? I think that's water. Oh, thank God. Oh, ow! Ow! Oh! No fair! No fair, I got... Poisons! Oh, no fair. Where, where are we? Oh. 
So we got the key, but I, we've missed the secret. And honestly, at this point, we were spending far too much time trying to figure out these secrets. Um, let's see, let me see. This was what, secret number two? Okay, hold up to get the second secret. Run past the movable blocks. The room where you found the save crystal. Okay, no, it has Desert Eagle and Uzi Clips. We're gonna go after that. I don't I don't care. Um load. Oh, fuck. Shit. <laughs> Gotta move these blocks back. Um, uh, how? Was that what I wanted to do? I have no idea. <laughs> Got this noise. Okay, hang on, hang on. Um, so what we're doing is we the movable blocks, the room where you found the save crystals. Run back, I guess. Uh, take a sand and jump from the edge of the blade-lined pit. Reverse the left, flat area in the corner. What blade pit? This blade pit, okay. Oh, this noise. I'm putting my faith in the walkthrough here. It says, move to the left. E. To avoid taking damage from the sharp blades, duck before moving it. What was duck again? There it is. And then crawl through the blades. Say anything to the low tunnel. Oh, shit. That's gonna hurt. Look at that. Fucking hell, who put those there? Hey, we got it. Shit, I thought I saw something. What the Get some guns. We've only got the shotgun and the regular pistols. Now, someone was saying yesterday that the collectible crystals, as they are now called, they heal a little bit of health. So let's find out. 
They don't cure poison. And I honestly don't think they gave us any help. Eagle. Is that what we call the desert eagle? I'm going to call it the beagle. Like the dog. Okay, so we have our two keys for the room that. I remember where it was? Where are we going? Let's take a look. Where is our next secrets? Um, secret number four we got. Yeah. Oh, wait, 404. Oh, yes, I'm glad we got that one then. I thought there was going to be, I thought there was going to be like 20 on each level or something. Eagles are the best dogs, says Hufan. I don't think I have an opinion on what the best dog is. I have a low opinion of some dogs. Not really the dog's fault, but you know, like sort of dogs that are bred for aggression and for hunting and stuff like that. They don't make good pets. Um, nothing against the dogs themselves. Eagles seem cute though. Is this a trap? Oh god, it's a trap. Oh no, oh, I fucked it up because of the camera. Fuck's sake. Go, Lara. We're gonna die. Oh, I know. Come. Mm, this is a bad plan. Can we just crouch in here? No, because we're gonna get stuck. This is a bad plan. I thought of the plan and then realized it was probably a bad plan once it was already too late. Sorry, Lara. I mean, it can't come down and get... Oh, it can come down and get me. Okay. How is that possible? There's like one piece that's like, no, fuck you. I'm getting you. I'm going to move through the floor just to get you in that pit. Not a great plan. Yes, indeed. Go, 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 go. Oh, Chihuahuas. Yeah, Chihuahuas are fucking nasty. They, they're very aggressive. Oh, Lara. That's not really her fault. Oh, monkey. Oh, oh, oh. Fucking ninjas. Ninja monkeys. Don't fall down. Oh, this is gonna fall on the spikes.
Open sesame? Um, how do we, how do we open this door? Hello, I would like to gain entry to the place where you keep your hidden artifacts that are very valuable. I just want to look at them. Just, I'm just going to lick them maybe once. Like it's a TikTok challenge, I'll put them back. Promise I'm not going to steal them much. Just for a little while, you know, I'm not, I'll just borrow them. They belong in a museum. Please, please may I have your valuable sacred artifacts? God, this game is way too dark. The sounds in this game remind you of some of the sounds of BD in the uh, Jedi games. <laughs> See a lever. <gasps> All right, I saw it and I ran forward instead of jumping and then she couldn't react in time. Damn it! I knew there would be something there. This place is full of traps. <sighs> go, go. Oh, you cannot get away with not taking any damage. Um, Doc says, so I was watching another stream yesterday and apparently the hand icon replaced the exclamation point for the actionable items across the board. They also enlarge those small ass keys for Tomb Raider 3, do you mean? Or because the, the icons were, um, it wasn't the hand, it was the exclamation point in the, in Tomb Raider 1 and 2 in this remaster, whereas on PlayStation, they didn't have icons, right? No, the hand is new to Tomb Raider 3. Unless, oh, unless you mean, has there been an update or something? Because when we were playing Tomb Raider 2, there was an update yesterday. Okay. Did we start this yesterday? We did. Okay, so this must have updated before before I started playing because it was Tomb Raider 3 was just the hand. I like the exclamation points. I don't like the hand. The hand seems... Well, you can tell it's not original. You can you can tell it's like new. Um, did they change the camera then? That would explain why the camera's all fucked up. Is the camera you used to press these buttons to make it go up and down? And now it doesn't. You have to kind of point it up and then move forward. And then rotate it, which is so stupid. It's kind of, it's all right if you're flying a drone. But if I want to just like adjust, you know, where we're looking at her. Say we've got it lined up like this. I know that's a terrible shot. Let's like, say I just want to like lose a little of the headroom. I, I can't. Hmm. Yeah, it's really dumb. They really fucked that up. Oh god, now what? <laughs> oh god, fire. Can we crawl under it? Let's find out. I feel like so much of this game, so many of these traps are going to be circumnavigated, oh no, by crawling. Oh no, 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 I don't like these beasties. <gasps> these things, there's two of them. Oh god, they're just, they're so spidery, they scare me. I don't like it. I don't like it. Where's Dandy Denny to tell me, are you having... 
Star Wars Jedi flashbacks. Oh, ooh, I just don't like them. Oh, my neural bug! Like that, I thought that one moved. So in the original, you would come in through here, you wouldn't even see him. Oh. Um, I reckon I can maybe climb up there to avoid them. Do it. Ah! No, thank you. No, thank you. Oh. They get me up here. Hello, and who else do I see come in? Do I see someone else come in? Jeremy! Jebbear! Hello! And Raphael! I knew I saw Raphael's name. Hello, welcome in. Um, Raphael says our dog is part shepherd, husky, and Labrador mix. Oh, That's cute. And reminds me of the mouse cursor on a PC game. Yeah, I think that's what it is. It seems very PC game-ish. What was wrong with the exclamation point? I, that was pretty obvious what you had to do. Like, there's something to pick up. Jeremy says, made it. Can't stay. Enjoy the stream. Thank you for being here, Jebba. I appreciate it. I appreciate you popping in. <laughs> I like that comment. Um, Doc says, the dev said, so you complained about the lack of tombs in Tomb Raider 2, huh? Well, get ready for Tomb Raider 3. You'll be in that tomb forever. It's just all tomb all the time. Extra tombage. I swear in the original they would like curl up like the spider. I may be having flashbacks too. Oh, there's another one. Oh my God. Like, what do you do? Oh, they are like spiders. I don't like them. I don't like them. I may be having flashbacks to Tomb Raider 2 with the the giant spiders. All right, come on, let's do it. Let's do it. What you got? Did they drop a sword? Am I supposed to pick that sword up? Can I pick that sword? Oh, I wield it. Come on, Lara. No way that fits in your little lunchbox. Oh. Oh. Oh, it's water. The water's like almost invisible in this. Oh, I'm about to give this thing its sword hand. Scimitar. Well, no to you too. Sorry, I didn't know there was a left-handed and a right-handed scimitar. Love the way they protect themselves. Don't love the way they look at me. Especially don't love the way they roar. Using Tombage. I feel bad after I misread it and was like, Tombage? What does Tombage mean? So now I've got to use it all the time. Insert Mortal Kombat theme. I have a Mortal Kombat gif. Uh, where'd I put it? That one. The gif's working. 
Yeah. Is this one gonna come to life? Please don't kill me. I gave you your hands back. Please don't kill me. Well, I don't think we really gave it hands. We just kind of like duct taped the swords to its limb, its uh, its stumps. I guess Lara really needs to walk so Nate can run. James! James Guan! Welcome in. Oh! Dude Raider! Oh, hello. Uh oh. I like all these doors closing behind me. Makes me nervous. Hubert! Hello, hello! Excuse me, sorry Lara. Didn't mean to be all up in your business. Okay, question. Question for everyone. So, well, question for Doc Renny. You said that there'd been an update yesterday. Can I delete that update and we can go back to how we were playing it before? What else? Do you know what else they did? Because I'm... I'm kind of tempted because I don't like the hand thing and uh, they really messed up the camera. Camera irks me. This is ominous. Definitely ominous. Not if you bought it digitally. Really? Are you sure? Oh no. Because I know um, you can somehow delete updates. How, I don't know how you see updates. Like, what? View products? No, I don't. How do you even see the updates? I remember doing it on the PS4. You could delete the updates without having to uninstall. Any way to downgrade it to have it physically delete the game, reload it with the disc? Huh. I, you can't undo an update. Huh. Weird, weird, weird. Um... Shit, I don't even know what I'm doing now. Play game, there we go. Oh god, oh no, oh it's like that, oh no. Oh, fear, fear, fear has entered the room. It's that dude, it's that, oh god no, it's not that dude. Oh. See, this is where we need to lift the camera up, not have to do this. Um... Boy, oh, got a hole through him. Ooh, I remember this, but I don't, I don't remember. Why does he have a hole in it? Why does he have a hole through him? Why does he have a hole through him? Bro, what happened? Oh, I'm guessing that's the exit side. It'd be so cool if he was facing this thing so we could do like a cool um like photo mode like peeking through the hole like the monster thing oh what how there's a key how
Oh, shit. Um, I need coffee. I need to save again. I know we just saved it, but I'm going to save it again. I don't care. So what do we, what do we have? Okay. Oh. Ooh. Hey, but Terrace had two coffees. Starting to get jittery. Indeed. I think it's the coffee that's getting me jittery. Oh, shit. Um, a trapdoor? Oh, God, there's going to be a lever somewhere, isn't it? Oh, sh there it is. We're not going to make it. We're not going to make it. Go! Oh! Lara! No, we didn't make it. I don't even know what that did anyway. I was a total Jill sandwich. I need a rest in the evil gift. That's what I need. All right, well, fuck that room. Um, hi. Really like some, I don't know, Uzis or... Something. Oh, there's a, there's a hole. No, 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 no! Ouch! We're gonna die. No, no, stop, stop it. Ah, we're dead. Ah. Oh. Okay, so we've got a room that kills us. We've got water that kills us. Let's see what's down here. like a key or something. Oh, 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 I didn't notice there's another guy. You also have a hole in you? No, he's just like hanging there. What happened? You dropped some flares. Can I have them? You, you, don't, you don't mind. Right? You don't need them. <laughs> Laura turned into a grilled cheese Sammy. Grilled cheese Sani. The panini press. Oh, and there's a door up there. My, what? Oh, I wonder if the lever in this little hole here opened that door. Um, all right, let's try it again. Go, 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 go. I don't know if we're going to be able to get out of this room. Also, that's loot. You know me, I'm compelled to loot. Loot at any cost. Ooh, 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 ooh. We can get out. She's gonna die. Does the black sort of mark have anything to do with anything? We have to we must have to turn off the Oh look! God damn it, there was a block in the middle. I wonder if there's a lever on that that we can pull or something that will not make it quite so um currenty.
Oh shit, we just triggered the thing. Kill him. Go get Lara. May take a while. Oh, that's down the pierce. Let's make you mad, bro. Let's make you mad. I killed it for a second. I was like, it went still. Come on, come on. It's a fine line between like getting it to attack you and obviously not getting attacked by it. There we go. Just yet. I want to go back to that swimming room. So this is the the crazy guy who um, we met in the jungle. These are his his friends. I forget what he called them. But he, when he made a comment about they're not coming, they're not coming out of the temple. Oh, it pulls you to the side. Oh, okay. No, 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 no. God damn it, that hurt. Okay. So you can't stay in front of that block. I was hoping we could stay in front of the block. He seemed fun. Yeah, yeah, fun guy. Um, well, shh. Now we can get over here and pull this lever, but that... Does anything. I'm like pressing the button harder, like that's gonna help. Oh, 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 oh. oh there was a little give there. Mm, Laura, ah, she's gonna die. I don't think this is the way to go. Not yet.
Oh my god, we can't see anything. So there was a lever. Yeah. Oh, and there's another one there, maybe? Do we maybe have to pull both of them for that door to open? Let's try. Two? Yeah, there's two. Oh god, Lara, 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 we're gonna, yeah, no, we're, we're fucked up. But that is indeed what we have to do. Sprint, sprint, the sprint, we can sprint. Go, 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 go. Let me jump back and do it. Ah, no, 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 that's, that takes too long. Do it, Lara, do it! No. It's gotta be perfect. Uh, Rex says, hey babe, can you say hi to my co-workers, Sean and Antonio? Hello! Hey Sean, hey Antonio, how's it going? Go fast, quick like a bunny, Lara, quick like a bunny. There we go, there we go. Sprint. Yeah, we did it. Oh, shit. You don't stand there and get spiked in the top of the head. All right, well, we, we got, we've got two of these now. I feel like the, um, these keys are maybe from the gift shop and, um, they're not actually that valuable. Cause there's quite a lot of them. This is like the fourth, fifth one we've seen. Hmm. So I think maybe. Oh, oh, hello. There's keyholes here. Um, I was gonna say, I think maybe we do have to figure out the swim puzzle. Maybe it is something that, that we can do. I'm just not doing it right. I bet there's a lever on each side. Oh my word. There's a, there's gonna be a lever on each side of the, the, uh, the, the spikies. I bet that's what it is. I bet I didn't look properly. Go, 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 go. I can't help it. I'm like pressing the button so hard. No, Laura. No. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. It's going to hurt. We've got to switch sides. Come on, girl. Lever, lever, lever. Yes. What does that do? Did it turn off? It turned off the flow. Excellent. Ah, oh. yes. Sean Connery and Antonio Banderas? I mean... Might be. <sighs> we did it! Crazy guys just floating down. Wait, we're just shooting at him now? We're just shooting at everything. Everything and everyone. Lara's a fucking psychopath. <laughs> that 
dude's just like, ha 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 ha. How the fuck did he get that far? Well, he didn't go into the temple. He just, they were just outside it. And he was like, well, I'm just going to walk around the back. Oh, and he had a little vroom vroom. But also a rap. I don't know. It doesn't, we don't know anything about the plot of this one. In Lara's defense, he does seem a little serial, serial killery. But did he punch a hole in a, in the guy's chest and, and make him magically like float in the air? I don't think so. We missed six pickups. Hmm. But we found everything else. Uh, what are you guys feeling about the secrets and continuing to search for those? Because they are extremely complicated to find. Let's take a quick look at what we have in store for this level. How many secrets? Because honestly, I'm kind of over them already. Oh, hold up. Hang on, hang on. What was that? Um... Never mind. Okay. Ah, uh, there are... Five! Well, it says four slash five. What? What does that mean? Four or five secret? What? What? Oh, it's how many... Pickups. There. I don't understand this walkthrough. Um... Okay, secret number one, straight out the gate. There it is. The quad bike looks fun, but don't get on it yet. First, go after the secret. Turn around so the bike is behind you. Copy that. And... I see piranhas. Uh, follow the riverbank. Blah, 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 blah. Oh, God. I, I can't tell you, I'm so happy that we can just save it whenever we want now because playing this game previously on the PlayStation, the original, I know I say this all the time, the original, you would use those save crystals that we have with 13 of them. Compare that to how many times I have saved this game. 83 times. We would have been able to save it a tenth of the amount of times because you also want to make sure you save some of them for later because you don't know you don't know how uh how hard it's going to be you don't know what's going to come what's going to be you know coming up oh there's a ladder I shouldn't have got her to step on it with her feet. She moves so much faster when she's just hanging there. Probably because she's desperate to get off it. She's like, please, 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 can I make it? The River Ganges. Oh yeah, I should have known this was in India, like, back when I was playing it. Because it says, the River Ganges, it's quite obvious. But in my defense, you do see why you don't really know where you are or what's going on, because... It doesn't tell you much. Oh, piranhas. I also, I think, have been mixing it up with the fifth one. Revelation, the last revelation.
Who <laughs> see the piranhas come? Did you see the piranhas come? They were like, lunch! Lunch! Ah, oh, never mind. It's not like there's a lot of good meat on her. Although, muscles, she has... Oh, she must have fucking good muscles. Okay, it says we're going to enter the room for secret number one, but like, um, how do we get back out of here? Oh, hold on. So that wasn't even the tricky bit. The tricky bit's still to come. We've got to figure out this jump. Oh, that's easy enough. Wait, there were sharp blades in here? Oh yeah. Oops, didn't see those. That's secret number one. Secret number two, uh, how many did we say we had five in this? So the next one we are looking out for, oh my gosh. Again, choice of paths. We'll miss the secret if we choose the wrong one. Um, left. So right path, you get to explore more of the runes, but you miss one of the secrets. Left path leads upward through a series of caves along the river, bypasses the ruins, but enables you to find all the secrets. And this is why we're using a walkthrough, because I don't know these games that well, and if we want to get all the secrets, they're so easy to miss if you make a wrong choice. Um, so we want to go left path along the river. That's what we're looking out for. Oh, this will be on... Mod bike? Right. Um... I would not swim in the Ganges. Mm-hmm. Too many crocodiles, dead bodies, and... I would imagine lots of sewage. Piranhas, piranhas. Secrets are for trophies and completionism? Well... I mean, yeah, but also there's a secret level. If you get all the secrets, it unlocks a final level, which is in London, which is my favorite of all of the levels in this game. Oh, shit. No, that's going to happen. Oh, piranhas. Ah. Well, fuck. We're, we're... I don't even know. Where are we going? We are we oh we're gonna die. Yep, we're gonna die. I'm kinda curious, where is this taking us? Are we just going around in a circle? Do we just go around in a circle? Oh, are we not getting eaten by all these piranhas? What the 
Yeah, she's gonna drown. You can't you can't actually surface. Waterfall, 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 go over the waterfall! Lara! Ah, and we died. That was pretty fun. Um yeah. Oh Adam! Hello, hello. Uh, so, yeah, what were we talking about? Yeah, you get an extra level. And I've never played it because I've never got all the secrets because, I mean, they're just fucking impossible. I'm playing on PlayStation again, as I said, with the lack of saving ability. Um, it really, it really just, it makes it impossible. You really need to have played it. I assume on PC would let you save anywhere. Probably. Um, I don't know for sure. Pretty sure there aren't piranha in India. Oh, I'm sure they did their research. They must have done. They must have done. They they researched the other the other game so well. I have no idea. No, I think they're. Are they not? Oh, are they? South American. Oh. Um, Arthur Shaw, hello, hello. Are you ever going to play Red Dead Redemption 1? Yes, yes, I am. I am. Yes, I'm going to play that, that PS5 port. I am indeed. It is on the list. Um, I actually, I really want to play it like right now. But we have the schedule, the, the lineup, I should say, is we're going to keep playing woo, this game. And then in two weeks time, slightly less than a week and a half we're going to be playing rise of the ronin that comes out march 20 something 22nd i think it comes out we'll be playing it on the 25th monday the 25th and that week actually we're going to be doing a mega stream event um that week monday tuesday wednesday thursday we will be streaming for longer i'll be doing these super long streams um just kind of for fun and because i want to and I want to play Rise of the Ronin of oh, Fuck Tongue because it looks amazing. I'm so excited for it. So we'll be playing that. Um, and then after that, yes, I think we may very well do Red Dead 1 to that. There's so many games, so many fucking good games I want to play. And there's, I mean, I, we play for hours and hours every day. And there's still always a backlog of great games. But yes, thank you for asking. And and emphatically, yes. Yes, we will be playing it. I also really just want to play Red Dead 2 again. Rise of the Rojitsu. That's the game that looks like Ghost of Tsushima. Yes, yes. Ghost of Tsushima, but you can like glide on like a flyer thing. Um, the combat is, it looks really cool. It's a little more... Um, I don't know, a little harder, a little more, um, I don't even know what it, how to call it. I haven't played it yet, so I can't say for sure, but from what I've read about it, the combat looks a little more intense, uh, maybe a little more fast paced, but yeah, it looks cool. It looks really fucking cool. Whoa. What is up in here? Oh shit, cha-ching. I'm interested in Rise of the Road if it plays more like Ghost of Tsushima than Nio, Neo, and Dark Souls. I think it's sort of going to be halfway in between the two. Like it's more Souls-like than Ghost of Tsushima, but it's not a Souls-like game. Which honestly, I, I feel like it might be Ghost of Tsushima, Ghost of Tsushima meet something like Jedi Fallen Order in terms of that combat style and, and you sort of have to get good and um, unlock abilities, moves, whatever. Um, but it also just looks gleefully fun. Reading one of the reviews of it, the early reviews, it seems like the kind of game where they, would, they knew what people want from a game. Which is the same as Ghost of Tsushima. It's like they, they wanted, they were like, what would it be like to play a samurai movie? Go. 
That's what they gave you. There's nothing about that game that wasn't, hey, let's play a samurai movie. Oh my word, this thing. Oh, we are gonna crash so many times. Am I supposed to just be flinging this into the Ganges? Oh, oh God, it wants me to... We're gonna jump over there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're totally gonna make this. Oh, it does have a reverse. Oh. What a sprint. Nope. <laughs> the controls are crazy. I'm claiming that one. I'm saving that one. If it sucks, can we just play Days Gone? Yeah. Quad bike time. Um, what is Shogun? Is this a TV show? Also, speaking of TV shows, isn't it next month that Fallout comes out? Oh, God. Oh, God. The steering is oh, kind of over the top. Yeah. Um. Mm. Oh, the stuff down there. Let's get that stuff. Um. How do we get off? Nope. Hello. Off. Exit. Exit. Jump. Oh, it's so hard. Circle to get off. Where was it we fell down? Was it here? Aha. Uh -huh. That was the secret. Um, did we accidentally take the left path already? I didn't even see a right path. Showing is based on the novel of the same name. It's about feudal Japan in the 1600s. Oh, sweet. Characters fictional based on real people. Of the Sengoku period. Um, a British sailor who is. Oh! It's made into a mini series of. Oh shit. Oh fuck. Wait, what was that? I, s <laughs> I saw the hand come up and I, I don't even know. Um. Oh, the remake. I was going to say, I, I thought that was already a thing. So what platform is it on? I haven't heard of it. I must not have. Is it on like Hulu or Netflix or something? I bet it's on Netflix. I don't have Netflix. Hulu. Okay. I haven't had Hulu in a while. I uh, I was watching The Handmaid's Tale, which I love. Um... Oh, it's FX. That makes... Oh, that explains why it's good. I love FX. FX shows are fucking awesome. Um, but yeah, I haven't had Hulu in a long time. For about a year. I just... The only thing I was watching was The Handmaid's Tale, and I finished the last season and was like, well... I think I need to take a break from paying fucking what what was the cost of that? What it how much does Hulu cost? Like 18 bucks a month or something? Mmm. The three body problems coming out on Netflix, my favorite modern sci-fi book. Did I watch The Bastard Executioner? That was the Kurt Sutter one. Right? Um Hulu's $5.99 alone? 
No, it's more than that. Isn't it? Uh, pro tip every Black Friday, Hula has a sale where you get 12 months for $1.99 a month. Yes, Doc. Yes, you're right. You are right. Um, Hulu and Disney Plus is $9.99 a month. See, I pay a lot more than that just for Disney Plus. I must have like the no ads version. Would you like to sign up? Let me sign you up. Because I pay for Disney Plus for the kiddo because he's got to have cars and Spidey and um, all of that stuff. Toy Story. Star Wars. We just got into Star Wars. Okay, so... I'm confused because... Oh, hang on, hang on. I skipped one. Okay, that was secret number two. Excellent. Oh, we found secret number two all on our own. Okay, and now we get the choice of paths and we want the left-hand path. Brings back memories. Yeah, Kurt Sutter. I didn't like it, to be honest. Um, I think I, I think I only watched like one or two episodes. That was a while ago, though. Are you serious? We're gonna make a jump. We're gonna do a turn and a jump. I hate these bits. Yeah, sounds vanicky. Sounds vanicky, dude. Oh, that's not gonna. We're gonna get out of this. Nurik, hello, hello, welcome in. How's it going? Oh shit, we made it. How did we make it? There's no way we made that. Oh, don't fall. I'm taking every jump. So the reason Kurt Sutter was so, um, did such a good job with Sons of Anarchy, if I remember correctly, he was actually, his history, he was in like a bike club, an MC, whatever, and he had, oh, I don't, I don't know the details, but he had like inside information on how things like that work, and that was sort of one of the selling points, yay, we made it, um, for him setting up that show he he was not really um a writer necessarily he just had a lot of experience now i can't say for sure but i'm pretty certain he doesn't have experience as an executioner in wales in the 1300s so to write something like that i'm not saying he can't write it but to write something like that you need to you need to be a good writer, I guess. Um, and that's maybe was not his strong suit. Did I come up here without pulling a lever? Can we get through this door? Can we just shoot it? Can we just drive through it? Can we just drive through it? Nope, that's the wrong one. And open. Oh. No. Uh, honestly, no, not really. I didn't. Again, it, it's a it's a weird writing thing. Like it was fine. Um, I watched two seasons of it. I think. Um. Four. I watched two seasons and I honestly just thought that the idea of the the MC just didn't really make a lot of sense to me. 
Like their their business model. Aha, there's something. Are you going to be able to get back over there? Their business model made zero sense because they were constantly losing money, losing their drugs or their money or their whatever, their people. Um, I see that snake. I see that snake. And they had like a really successful like repair shop. Like just run that and you'd be fucking loaded. The amount of people that were in in the club, like are you going to wake up? Um oh god. David Whalen! Hello, hello, welcome in. How have you been? I haven't seen your name in a little while. Um Yeah, <laughs> Jack, yes. My reaction to Sons was how the fuck are these people so stupid? Why is Jack so stupid? Why is Gemma such a mm, a coconut? I guess I wanted Jack's. Uh, I guess Jack's wanted the club to go legit, but he was too naive for that. Season four was the best. Uh, it was driving the ultimate confrontation. Then it delayed it for a few more seasons. Dude's twitching. I see you twitching. Gotcha. I see all those little hearts and, and confetti things going up there. Yeah, I don't want to insult it because I know a lot of people like the show and I'm not saying it was a bad show. Just for me personally, I am a little bit of a stickler for like believability. She says playing this game, um, which is it. if the world of the game um, or, or the story, whatever it is, if it's hyper realistic, you know, if it's sci-fi, if it's fantasy or whatever, then cool, I'll I'll go with it. But if you're trying to tell me that this MC legit makes just they they think that they're gonna make more money. Ooh, snake! God damn it! Did we get got we got fucking poison? Oh, I'm gonna fuck you up. If you can shoot Lara. dead oh snakes have to be snakes i should have put that in as a gift um yeah i just i just don't i didn't buy it i kept thinking that they were just so stupid i'm like you're all just like getting shot and losing your stuff and i don't remember all the plot lines but you know what i mean like they're doing all of these illegal things and it's like just just being legit and you'd be fine. Ooh, hello. Oh, what? Um, do we leave the bike behind then? Oh, I'm guessing we leave the quad bike behind. No. There's a thing there and there's our quad bike. Okay, so before we climb down there, there's something back this way. down here. That's just the quad bike. That's just a way to get back into there if we've fucked up somehow. Ouch! Fucking snake, I'm mad about, mad about the snake. Ah! Ah! Get off me! I don't want to shoot you with the shotgun, I don't want to waste the shotgun shells, get off me! Fucking ninja monkeys, mother! Get away from me! Monkeys! Kill them monkeys! My word, I should have shotgunned them. Good lord! Exactly, being legit is boring. They're outlaws! Like, yeah, but then you get yourself killed and you lose all your money and... Oh my god, 96 saves. I just already on level three. What the hell? Uh, James, you prefer Mayans? I haven't seen that one. I avoided it because, you know. Oh, do you hear my stomach? Um, because I, I thought it would be, thought it would be pretty bad. 
Yeah, they gave off the impression there's nothing you can do other than illegal shit if you like the vroom vrooms. Uh, talking about MC's Tom Hardy and Austin Butler's new movie about MC's coming out. Ooh, you, uh, you, I, you say Tom Hardy and I just go into Tom Hardy world in my head. Tom Hardy is so good. He's so fucking good. He seems like a weirdo in like a good way as well. Like he's he's a really strange guy who kind of like doesn't give a shit about how he's seen or whatever. And he's so good at acting. He's so incredibly good. If you haven't seen The Craze, and I'm going to type it in the chat. Craze, K-R-A-Y-S, The Craze. It's the Cray Twins, the gangsters from the 60s, London, East London, 1960s. Brutal motherfuckers. Um, very sadistic, nasty, mean, horrible gangster people. Re but they were twins. And one of them, I think one of them was like a complete fucking sociopath. And the other one was also sociopath, but was like mentally disabled in some way or, or kind of kind of simple or something. He had like some sort of learning difficulties or whatever. Um, and, and you combine that with, with being a sociopath and a sadist and a gangster. Oh my God. So they, that's the history of it. They were real people. Tom Hardy, they made a movie of the Cray twins. Tom Hardy plays both twins, obviously. Holy shit. Holy shit. If you've not seen it. Oh my God. You've got to see it. It's so good. So fucking good. Yeah, Tom Hardy. Also, Taboo is such a good show. I really want them to make another season of that. It kind of didn't really make a lot of sense, necessarily. Um, but uh, I think that would have been better if they'd had a second season. That was insanely weird yeah it was like well, i don't fully get it tom hardy <laughs> i will watch tom hardy do nothing he's just so good love him and also i mean come on oh no 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 that's a massive pit holy shit i think we're gonna make this <laughs> no go that way go but then don't go Just in time for the crazy murder talk. Hey, Captain Caffeine. Welcome in. We're talking about uh, The Craze. K-R-A-Y-S. That's in the chat there. A movie with Tom Hardy. So good. They just said it and then everyone forgot about it. The uh, Taboo. Oh, wait. Um, I didn't know who the Craze twins were until Whitechapel. That was... Wait, what is Whitechapel? I used to live in Whitechapel. I love the history of Whitechapel. And that whole, that whole district, Shoreditch, was really where I lived. Bethnal Green. There's a lot of places around there. Ooh! Hang on! Okay! Ooh! I'll take it! I'll take it! Don't fall off! Don't fall off! Let's go! Let's go! Let's just... Does this music start up every time? The Shoreditch hipster! There's a man who knows London. I, no, I lived in, in Shoreditch and Bethnal. Well, Bethnal Green was becoming hipster at the time, but Shoreditch was still on. We had Brick Lane. I lived just off Brick Lane. And it was, they had the, the Sunday upmarket, Brick Lane Market. Oh, it was so good. That was, it was right around the time where it was um, starting to become a little hipstery, but it, the prices weren't hipster yet. It was, afford, it was affordable hipster. Mmm. Tom movie was called Lock. Yeah. I think I've heard of that. Uh, Whitechapel is a British crime series that starts with a Jack the Ripper copycat, then they encounter the alleged sons of one of the Cray twins. Oh, shit. All right, stream over. I'm going to go watch that. Uh, then they couldn't keep doing that premise. They had a historian moving oh these fine things move interesting um that's kind of trippy am i poisoned by the the snake um 
and a historian who advised the police on historical crimes that relate to modern ones. It was a really good show. The entire Lock movie is just Tom driving a car, speaking on a phone. I would watch it. I don't care. I don't care. And just Tom Hardy. Yes. Down to the stone bridge and dismount. Take sand and jump from... Okay, so this is where we're getting secret number three. Oh. Okay. Beep. And dismount. I feel like they really up to the game with the music. Oh, hello. Hmm. Oh, <laughs> music interrupted. Yeah, the music in this one, they, they kind of branched out from... Are you going to like that fly, Lara? branched out from feeling so stuck to, you know, to the orchestral classic. She looks like she's holding a flare. Oh, are we, are we actually, she's actually stuck. Oh, did we just glitch? She will not respond to any commands. Come on, Lara. Come on, Lara. Yeah, I kind of fucked it up. Oh, eep, eep. So many rock textures. Did I mod the game avatar to look like me? Aww. Thank you for saying so. But no, I did not. This is just Lara Croft. And, uh... I, I wish I looked more like Lara. Although the <laughs> the original, like, busted face is perhaps not, not the sexiest look. Um, hang on, let me go into photo mode. Damn it. it move the camera. So this is new Lara, which she kind of looks like the Lara Croft from the anniversary and the remake, the first remake of the, well, the only remake of the first game. That's original Lara, which is maybe a little closer to how I look. <laughs> it's kind of resting bitch face. <laughs> well, slightly less attractive, let's say. New Lara, she looks very cartoon-ish, but I'm not mad about it. Um. Mm -mm. Oh, hey, Warhorse! Warhorse came in! Snow Buried Monument! Oh, Old Lady Deep Geek alone! Yeah, I love that. The competition show, right? The put people... Oh, shit. People in the wilderness. Um, it's snowing here too, and it's weird because it was raining this morning. It had obviously snowed overnight, and then it started raining, and I was like, well, the snow's not going to stick. And then as I was taking the kiddo to his school, it started snowing again, but it was like wet, sleety kind of snow, like sort of snow, but you know it's not going to stick because it's too, it's too wet, and the ground's too wet, and it's not cold enough 
you know, all of that stuff. And I took Finn into the uh, into school and his teacher was like, so just to let you know, if it keeps going like this, we're going to close the school tomorrow because the roads are going to be bad and it's supposed to be this weather until, um, until tomorrow, this time tomorrow, I think. And I was like, no, no, it's not going to, it's not going to be, ooh, I'm not going to do that. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, stop. I don't know where the break is. Um, but yeah, it's actually snowing a lot now. I go with this music again. Um... You can't see out the windows because some of the snow is covering the screens. Blasphemy! OG Lara is a goddess! I mean, she is. She is. Uh, currently they're talking about closing the I-25 between Colorado Springs and Denver. All around Denver is already shut down? Okay, I need to get a better app on my phone because I I just downloaded a new app. Um, just the, the weather app or something. Like the standard, um, you know, that app. But I feel like... I feel like it still doesn't really convey what the weather is actually going to be like. Maybe I just need to watch the, the local news or something. Local weather report. Never have the TV on though. But yeah, I always fill out the loop when people say like, oh, it's, it's supposed to, you know, rain from this time to that time. I'm like, how do you know? It's weird when you move to a new place and you've got to recalibrate everything you think you know about local, local weather. Um, okay, so we got this. We got the secret. Next secret will be. The next secret. Oh my word. Yeah. Not seeing it. Oh, again, we have two paths converge again. Oh, my word. Um, this is so complicated. So we're looking for, we shoot two vultures and we're doing some climbing stuff along the river. Good Lord. I, I'm not trying to use the walkthrough, but holy shit. Being snowed in sounds... Ooh, backwards, backwards. Um, sounds like a comfy pajama slash warm drink type of day. Bourbon type of day. Oh yeah. That's not gonna happen if speed Lara with you chunking it on the, on the wall there. You know it's bad when even Space Force closes the base the day before. Holy shit, is it really going to be that bad? I had a reminder on my phone yesterday to water the plants. Um, I turned that off. Seemed unnecessary. So close. No idea if we're supposed to be taking the, the bike up here. No idea what we're doing. No fucking clue. Oh, I see I see stuff over there. Can we We need the bike to get up there? I I don't know. We're on the tree tops.
Uh, she cannot reach that. Mm -mm. See, I... Oh, I'm going to sneeze again. Nope, no sneeze. To me, like, this this level of snow... Now, I don't know about up in Denver and Springs. Like, it's obviously it's probably snowing a lot more there. Um, But down here, the, the kind of snow that we get just don't buy that it's please stop that it's heavy enough to like close the schools and stuff it just doesn't seem to get that heavy a ladder They seem to freak out about snow here. I don't know. I I call it freaking out. I'm perfectly comfortable driving in like bad weather, inclement weather, as we would say in the UK. No fucking way, James. It's 27 degrees Celsius there. That's like what? What is that in Fahrenheit? Like 80 something, 85 something like that. Give or take a few. Wait, hang on. What? Um, it's already bad up here. 24 inches on the ground since nine last night. Oh, shit. Oh, we only just... I'm literally looking at it on the fence post and there's like that much snow on the top of the fence post. And that's only B. Like I said, it was raining. There was a little bit of snow overnight and then it was raining this morning, which had washed everything away, which is why I thought it wasn't going to stick. Because usually, in my experience, it's different here. Like I said, I'm having to recalibrate for everything. Um, but in my experience, if the ground is wet, if it's rained, it's unlikely to um, unlikely to stay. Uh, stay snowy. I don't even know. I'm completely lost. There. Hmm. I see climbing. I see places we can drive through. Ah, the two paths converge, maybe? Maybe this is the bit. Oh, 80. So 27 degrees is 80.6 Fahrenheit. I overestimate it a little bit, but still, it's just so fucking hot to say we've got snow coming down. Uh, monument is uh, 7,100 feet above sea level, which puts us above the snow line most of the time. Yeah, here it's like just shy of 5,000, I think, elevation. What do we reckon? What do we reckon? Can we... It off. Travis is working. Working and working. We can make that as a jump. Nope. Oh, my bad. Oh, that crunch! That crunch. That was a hard one. That must have hurt. Well, maybe not. Oh, okay, we can't make that. I don't know what we're missing out on. Well, there's a monkey. Fuck you, monkey. Fuck you. Fucking monkeys. There's another one. Oh my god, Zalara. Can you believe it? Vultures, vultures, vultures! I can't run those over! Ah! That 
Yeah, vultures exist in India, right? Did anyone look up piranhas? Meh. Meh. You kill it? Lara right now. Rooney Claire. She's the one killing all the endangered wildlife. Oh, this is the bit where we died earlier. Okay, let's have a look. So I saw kill two vultures. Um Oh no, we've missed a we've missed a bunch. We've missed a whole fucking bunch. Um It also says get off the bike and shoot the two monkeys. Oh god, what? Uh... Just... I'm gonna look at the- I'm gonna look at the screenshots. Oh no, that was the- wait. That jump where we died? That was where we go to get the secret. Okay, now you know what I'm gonna. I'm calling it on the secrets. It's this. It's too crazy. It's too fucking crazy. I don't even know where we're supposed to be going in the game, let alone to get all these extra secrets. Oh, that part of me is like, but we've already sunk so much into this. Oh, hello. Oh, shit. Sunk cost fallacy about to play out live. I, I know. No, but it's like uh, I want them. I want. I want the loot. Is what I want. Oh no, that's not a good idea. Um. I want the guns, if there's like guns to get. Because all she has so far is the pistols and the shotgun. Yeah, and then when you get there you say, we did all that for this? You know you want to lo unlock that London level? Oh, God, I do. I do. I do. Oh, I can't. I can't, I can't decide. Well, okay, we just found a secret. I thought, wait, the screenshots showed something to- I'm so confused! Everything looks the same, and of course the screenshots, bear in mind, are the old version of the game. Alright, well we got- we, we got the secret. Um, so that would be secret number four? Or five? All right. I, keep, oh, I just don't want to. I don't want to have to stare at the walkthrough for so long. Um, I see that med kit down there, but I know that there are piranhas. I'm not falling for it. Oh shit! How do wait? How do we? Wait, wait, wait! How do we get off this? Maybe we have to. Hold on. Did I save it? Did I save it in here? <laughs> I 
frozen dead vulture. Oh, no piranhas in this pit. Did you, are you going to pick it up? Thank you. I'd really like to get out of the water. Ah. really like to see where I'm going. Oh! We... We skipped like half of the level! I guess that was secret number five? What just happened? Hold on, hold on, because on the walkthrough... It's like, go to the ruins, pick up a key. I... That was secret number five. Oh, shit. Well, shit. Four out of five. No, says so I mean, we can go back. Do you want to? Now we know how to do that bit. We can we can just reload a slightly earlier save. Um I, th I think I know. I think I know how to do it. Fuck it. Let's see if we can do it because we have let me make a save. So this is save 108. And let's go back to save. Oh, it load, right? Yeah. No, we want 103. Get off it, get off it. So I'm 99% sure. Oh, it's a slide and grab. Nope. Fuck that up. What do I hear? What do I hear? What's trying to kill me? Vultures. To leaning back and shoot him one handed. No, Lara. Oh, my word. I'm just gonna, <laughs> just gonna start over. Okay, it helps if you actually read all of, all of the text. What vultures sound like?
now we know why the screenshots looked wrong. Yeah, I was like, I'm pretty sure, but it's hard to tell when it's like all rocky textures and viney things. Jeez. I'm only going to be able to make that if we go down backwards. I'm literally doing it like this. Hey, we got it. We got it. Lara walks so coquettishly. It's not a word you hear very often. <laughs> She's a lady. Oh, that's not how we get down. Um, mm, how do we get down from here? Fuck, we're kind of fucked now. It's just humorous, this badass gunslinging adventurer walking so daintily. I know, right? That's one of the many, many things I love about Lara is how... Oh, I see. Uh, she just... back how she is you know her own kind of set of contradictions her own um i don't even know how to describe it like she just does her own thing and she's like yeah i walk like a lady talk like a lady um but I'll also kill like a fucking sociopath. You can take the girl out of the British aristocracy, but you can't take the British aristocracy out of the girl. It's like me. That is actually really true. It's like, I, I'm born, born and raised working class, proud of it. And um, never be anything but that. Oh, we left our... We left our... Do we... We only need the, the quad bike to run over the monkeys. Which honestly was kind of fun, but... Oh, we don't necessarily need it. Come on, monkeys. Come on, monkeys. I can't believe you can skip so much of this level. Ben Holt, hello. You got a lot of free time now. What game should you platinum? Out of Bloodborne, UFC 5, or Sifu? Um, I have played none of those games, so I'm going to say Sifu. Bloodborne, I think, would be really hard. I think Sifu is also a hard game. Um, In Vulture Gangbang. Easy. Easy. Don't you fall off, girl. Don't you fall off. Don't let these vultures push you around. But yeah. I don't know. It's up to you.
This is not the way we came on here. This is, uh... We drop down? Yeah. I had a moment where I was like, um, can I make that jump? No. No is the answer. No, I would not have made that jump. I'm honestly gobsmacked at snowing so hard. Like, I had no idea it was going to be snowing this hard. So it's not like... Um... Tomb Raider 2, where when you get the secret, you can get, like, a fuck ton of extra ammo and stuff for getting all the secrets. There's no reward for getting all of the secrets, with the exception of the final level. Um, no, no immediate in-game, here, have a bunch of stuff. But the secrets themselves are often, well, they are loot-related. So you're getting a save crystal or you're getting um, pickups, but they're more like regular pickups rather than that massive boost that you would get in Tomb Raider 2. I cannot believe this is the end of the level. I had no idea. See if it was easy? Oh, okay. Well, then do that one first and then do one of the others. Uh, Warhol says, good chance I'm going to be out of work tomorrow too. The stuff is coming down hard. Not expected to stop until tomorrow afternoon. Five of five! Yay! We did it! We missed a ton of pickups still, but we got all the secrets. And now we are in the caves of Kalia? 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 Hmm. Caves of Lara Croft. Uh, okay, we're going to take a short intermission here. I'm going to go grab some coffee. Um, Travis, this is your much needed pee break. <laughs> we'll be back in just a few minutes. Don't go anywhere. Just grab a snack, grab a blanket, or turn the AC up, depending on where you are in the world. Um, and I'll be back in just a few minutes. Oh, what is it doing? Move! Move! Is that going to drop us down? I see a shiny on, like, a trap door. So going to drop us down in there, isn't it? Yep, knew it. Oh, hi. Now oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh. It ain't me. <laughs> For a second I was like, this is gonna go okay, and then no. No, 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 no. No, oh, move. Oh, 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 no, 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 no. Someone say that was hard. 
it's one of our dose I can try, bitch. Did I breathe through any of that? I don't know if I actually took a breath. Cyberlife conducts a survey to know what users think. Do you want to participate in a survey? I have no idea what this is. I was expecting a loading screen. So sure. Great. Would you consider having a relationship with an android that looks like a human? I don't know. I really like the movie Her with Joaquin Phoenix and Scarlett Johansson, where he falls in love with an AI. I find it exceptionally believable. Like it, it really is. It's not like he was like, oh, I think I will have a relationship with my operating software. It just kind of happened. So I could consider relationships with androids happening. We are emotional beings. So I could see it definitely happening just in general. Would I have a relationship with an android? Well, androids kind of freak me out, so maybe not. I'm going to go with personally, don't know. Couldn't say yes or no. Couldn't give a definitive answer. Would you consider having a relationship with a human that looks like an android? No. Not to be superficial and looks oriented, but if you look like an android, you're going to creep me out. Do you think that technology could become a threat to mankind? I feel like if I answer yes to this, it's going to be like, okay, bitch, it's on. Ah, uh, you can only bring one object. A book, a set, well, I mean, a cell phone, if it's a deserted island, it's not going to have signal. Pen and paper. Definitely. Do you consider yourself dependent on technology? Depends what level of technology we're talking about. Modern medicine is awesome. I, would, I very much not take any shame in considering myself dependent on that. Ooh, space tourism, I think is, I mean, it's already a thing, really. Do you believe in God? That was an Android easy one. Take care of your children? If I answered, I don't know, to would I consider having a relationship with an Android? I think I'd probably have to go with yes for this. Cause if we're talking about the androids from this game, they seem extremely competent. How much time <laughs> per day would you say you spend on an electronic device? Oh, wow. A lot. I stream for four hours a day, so at least more than four hours. If you needed emergency surgery, would you agree to be operated on by a machine? That one's easy. Yes. Do you think one day machines could develop consciousness? Well, that would depend on how you define consciousness. Is this going to be a sniper rifle, isn't it? <gasps> Please let me do this. Please let me do this. This is for the fucking best. Oh. Yes. Take the shot, take the shot. Is that him? Is he going to turn around? Oh, no. Got the hang. Shouldn't do this, Connor. Keep out of this, Lieutenant. It's none of your business. You're going to kill a man who wants to be free. That is my business. It's not a man. It's not a man. It's a machine. That's what I thought for a long time, but I was wrong. I'm going to accomplish my mission, Lieutenant, whether you like it or Frank not. Frank has now become the enemy. I advise you to stay out of my way. Then one of us is going to have a problem, Connor. Because I don't intend to let you have your way. What's up, Lieutenant? Ran out of whiskey, so you came here looking for trouble instead? Ooh. Oh. Very nasty, Connor. Is that the best your super program can do? Take the shot, Connor. Ignore him. Take the shot. Just take the shot. Just take the Away shot. From the ledge. I'm faster than you, and I don't feel pain. You don't stand a chance against me. You know, ever since Cole died, I've been nothing but a coward. Just wanted to destroy myself. Lost track of the man I was. But you know what? You don't fucking scare me, Connor. Oh, oh, you don't fucking scare me, Connor. I loved that game. I loved that game. If you want to see what happened at the end, what I chose, um, that is a video that is available on my channel. Just search. Oh, well, you don't even have to search. Just look at the videos tab, and you'll uh, you'll see you'll see it there. Um. His intermission screens again in fancy. The weirdest part of that movie was when someone asked him to strangle her with a dead cat. Oh my god, you're talking about... You're talking about her? Wait. Hang on. Wait, why are you bringing that? You've watched an old clip, another live. Did I bring that up in the... I don't even remember. Um, Because I put the videos on and then I walk away. Did we mention her? Oh, we did mention her, didn't we? Yeah, god. Strangle me with a dead cat. Wait, what? Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, yeah, strangle me. Strangle me with that dead cat. Um, I just shared on the Discord a picture of the snow uh, falling out of the window. Well, not out of the 
snow falling outside. View from my kitchen window um, on the Discord. Where's the Discord button? There it is. So yeah, if you're not already on the Discord, go join and uh, you can take a look at the the view at my kitchen window. So you can see it's snowing, but it's not like crazy snow. You can see where it's starting to settle, but it's not super deep yet. Um, Warhorse, you'll have to share a pic uh, out of your kitchen window or, or whatever, whatever window you can best see the, through the, the snow-covered screen. All right, let's get into it. Let's get into it. So caves of Kali. Oh, it was the Android questionnaire. Asked, would you date an Android? And I mentioned her. That was it. We need to take a look real quick. Um, no, I keep going back and forth. But yes, yes, let's do all the secrets as much as I can, as much as we can bear. If it gets too unbearable, we'll quit at some point. All right, caves of Kalia. We have no secrets. Oh, shit. Oh, that means boss fight. That means boss fight. Um, make your way through the maze. Hold on, hold on. There's a map. See pit number one, pit number two. Boulder trap. There's a three tiered labyrinth. Maze, technically. Why? No. I think maze. Sorry, just read the description. The beginning of this level is basically a three-tiered labyrinth. Below that is an anteroom. And finally, the room with the India boss, Tony. Tony. I'm going to fight Tony. There are a number of paths you can take to reach the bottom. Maps below. The most direct route, which bypasses the second level entirely, is marked with red dots. For all kills and pickups, be sure to explore each level thoroughly using the maps and text. As a guide, ah, we probably want pickups, fucking shells, medipack. There's a cobra, um, there's flares. Yeah, maybe we don't. Maybe it's not really worth it. Shotgun shells, and a med pack. I don't know. What do you guys think? Should we explore thoroughly? Um, Dandy Denny, hello, hello, welcome in, and Goma Black Magic, hi, howdy, like to share, thank you, Goma, I really do appreciate that you do that. Melissa, it's 80 where you are. Ooh, Warhorse has posted, has posted pics on the Discord as well, let me check them out real quick. Uh, ba -ba -ba. Parking lot, whoa. That was two hours ago, and I assume it's snowing. It's snowed more since then. Oh, yeah. Now, that's the kind of snow where it's like, okay, that's a snow day. Oh, shit. I just saw Amogus on Discord. Um, don't know if he's watching this, but uh, uh, he, I'm not sure if it's he or she, but they, let's say they, their grandmother just died. Fuck. If you're watching this, I'm sorry. Sorry for your loss. Um, a bit warm, bit warm, in it, a little bit, a little bit warm. It's a two foot drift in front of my car. Yeah, see here, it just doesn't doesn't get that snowy. This is going to be... This is a trap. This is definitely a trap. It's a trap. Oh, more horse. You lost your mother just last summer. Fuck. I'm sorry. I don't know if, you've, uh, if we've talked about that before, if you've mentioned it before. Oh, God, it's, it's behind me. I thought it was going to come. How do we avoid that? How did we avoid that? I don't know how I didn't get squished. I think I went the wrong way, though. 
Susie, we miss Susie clips. Yeah, fuck this. Fuck this. We're gonna we're gonna explore. I want everything. I want to loot everything. Loot it all. Nope. Oh wait, no, that was that was where we want to go. Oh, Lara, excuse me, excuse me. Getting a little, uh, a little up close and personal. Okay, so we can drop down right in front of us. And this hole in front of us takes you straight to the... Oh, God, I'm all tangled. Ugh. Takes you straight to the... It skips a level. Um... My mouse. We would miss out on some shotgun shells. And a small med pack. Yeah, I kind of want those. It's like nothing apart from cobras in the rest of this bit. I'm not going to look up how to... It has instructions on how to dodge this boulder, and there are other boulders, but we're going to figure it out. We're just going to do it. We're just going to fly by the seat of our hot pants. The boulder comes down up here. Was there... Hmm, there's no drop to... Drop off. Um... Go for that. Oh, I forgot we can sprint. Oh, God. I forgot we can sprint. Oh, did we make it? We made it still. So, there's another... Oh god! Oh, that actually made me flinch! Jesus! Good lord, it was the music more than anything! Holy cow! Ooh. Knew there was another boulder gonna come down, but I was not expecting it to go doo doo! Okay, so we...
see the cobra. It's a shame you can't kill them while they're asleep. Just shoot them with a harpoon. Okay, so now... I'm just trying to figure out how this map is laid out. Um, oh, oh, I see. Okay. Okay, we got all the pickups. We got all the pickups. Um, oh shit, we're about to walk into a lot of cobras. Alright, I'm gonna put the map away and... Let me catch up. Uh, Gomer, it's gonna be 80 where you are as well. Ah, uh, the south ain't no place for sissies. Yes, indeed. Colorado's mainly muddy in the winter. No, it's really snowy um and here i'm in like the south and here we don't get a lot of precipitation precipitation so it definitely doesn't get muddy um i don't know what it's like the other side of the mountains maybe but here on the eastern side of the state i'm like straight down from denver um no it's either snowy or dry <laughs> that's it um Always be Luton. Yes, indeed. Melissa, your mom passed in July of 2018. It gets easier still. A shitty club to be part of, though. Well, I'm sorry for you as well, Melissa. I'm sorry for, I'm sorry for everyone who's lost someone that they love. Um, it is sadly an unavoidable part of life, and yet... Still fucking sucks. Um, Dandy Denny, same, your dad passed away years and years ago. Some parts get easier. That's gonna make, make me cry. Like, I'm just... Just thinking about losing parents and stuff. 
I fortunately still have my my parents. Um, I'm not supposed to fall down the hole. But I know, yeah, like we all we all lose. Yeah, oh, shit, we all lose our parents. See that snake? I see you alive down there. We're so going to get eaten, aren't we, by snakes? Come on, Lara, you can do it. No. <laughs> I don't even know what my plan is here. Shoot everything. Take the hits. Oh god, there's a boulder! Oh, we're fucked. Oh, we got squished. There was a boulder. Let's just go shotguns. I only have eight rounds though. We're gonna take we're gonna get bitten by at least one snake, so we might as well just fucking do it. Eighty one flares, my word. Oh, there's someone alive. not actually poisoned well fuck i'm gonna save it then if i didn't actually get poisoned by any of them that's awesome no. oh god what do you mean no i'm just trying to roll Oh yeah, OLDG, you just had surgery. How'd it go? How'd it go? You're still pretty drugged up. Well, good that they're keeping you on the good drugs to help with the pain. Um, it'll be rough for the first couple of weeks, but I'm really looking forward to summer with the new knees. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. I don't know if we just saved it or not. Oh, come on, I know you're awake, snake. Snake wants to do anything. It keeps twitching. It's like shit, is that boulder gonna come and get us? This has got to be the boss fight. The music uh, it just has a low hissing built in to fuck with us. I think so. Oh god. Um. Oh. 
What did you just do? Oh god! No, that was lava. All right, he turned the ground into lava. So it looks like this is just a sort of jump and don't fall in the lava kind of situation. I'm gonna pick that up. <laughs> oh! Did the jump wrong. Last things first, I think I'm just gonna... That doesn't do anything to him when he's... Or now, you can't really hurt him. Do. God, go. Oh, we got Samphire. I was going to see if we can loot everything first. I think we, we probably could loot everything if we get the timing right. Because all he does is just stand there and shoot fire at us. No, don't look at him. Don't look at him. Can we get it? Can we get it? Oh no, we're not gonna get it in time. Wrong. Oh shit. Bit of wrong. You know, now I see him throwing fire and floating. Maybe he did kill his friends. Go, 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 go. All right, I'm going to save it because we got two of them. Oh, yeah, see, that's why I saved it. <laughs> What just happened? What's that? So this weird artifact that just turned this guy into a complete fucking psycho. He killed his friends. We're just gonna pick that up. We're just gonna be like, aha. Uh -huh. And pick it up. Seems legit. Why not? We're fucking Lara Croft. Why not? Hey. I don't want to be misrepresented by that retarded research you've just been with. Uh, Lara. I'm Dr. Willard. I'd come to converse with Tony myself, but I saw you were doing a rather more creditable job, I think. Indeed, I'm inspired. I'd like to offer you other work. What? Shoot the breeze with some of your other boys? No thanks. Fortunately, they were the only lab rats we let loose into the field. No. My request is for three other artifacts like this. The Infada tribe only had one artifact of this type. It's unique. Anyway, what would your interest in it be? I'll show you. It's not from India. Rather, an island near Antarctica. It is, in fact, meteorite rock that has been fashioned and used by Polynesians who were once settled there many, many years ago. See that? That's unique. An unknown material. So how did it end up here? 
Fawn from the planets, sculpted by Polynesians, distributed by goons. Our excavations and investigations have led us to this. A sailor's diary from Charles Darwin's expedition on the HMS Beagle. The Beagle! August 14th, 1834. This voyage is getting too boring for me to go on with this journal. Me adventures at sea are an embarrassment. Me adventures. I'll have to tell our hours of bird watching, picking and pressing flowers, following them blasphemous ideas of the governor, Darwin. But this don't even concern me now. I just want food. Something more than vegetable broth in me. Well, the fly in that one. Could have eaten that. The only sampling we're going to be doing is for meat. Pure, solid, blood rich meat. Of any kind? The snow's run out. The tracks have gone. Just keep going. We're on its trail. Not safe. Don't walk on that. There's something here. Look, another one. What do you reckon they're worth? Too late. There's only four. None for you. Oh. There's your meat. Doggy got impaled. Nobody better say nothing about this to the governor, else we'll be back having to hunt down that creature for his samples. Paul fell down a crevasse, okay? It's gonna say how you're gonna explain Paul. Stephen was to be the only survivor of the four. When he arrived back in London, he superstitiously sold off his artifact, having seen his pals murdered or killed with theirs. One here in India, one in the South Pacific, and one in Nevada. The places where I'd like you to go. Sounds good to me. Yay! Ten of ten pickups. Excellent. Oh! We get to choose. We get to choose. What did he say? There, one in the South Pacific, one in Nevada, and one. Did he say London? What he said somewhere else. Oh, one. No, I don't know. Um, I'm looking forward to reading this chapter in my Darwin book. Yes, yes, Doc. Let us know. <laughs> Let us know what it says. Yeah, pick up the evil artifact barehanded and just like stick it in your backpack. Choose your adventure. Well, we fortunately get to play all of them. Um, my favorite is London, but I think I always do South. I think I do South Pacific, then London, then Nevada. Nevada is the possibly the hardest one. Although South Pacific, I've kind of had my fill of um, underwater shenanigans. I think we'll save Nevada for last. Let's go to London. Let's go to my homeland. Well, actually, let's let's vote. You guys vote on it. What do you think? Nevada is Area 51. It's fucking badass. Um, I usually have the Desert Eagle there. I don't know if you pick it up there or don't recall. Um, but I know I always have it by the time I'm there. It's very helpful. So that one's it's kind of tough. London is great, but it's very dark. You go into the underground. It's a very dark series of levels. Um, you get hit by trains a lot, which I fucking love. 
Um, Land of Clare's forebears, forebearers, and then South Pacific. Uh, if I remember correctly, see, I'm mixing this up with the fifth game or the fourth game. Fuck, I don't fucking know. Um, where you um, you you go somewhere tropical like the South Pacific. Maybe it is this one I'm thinking of. I don't know, but it's very it's very pretty. The water is like bright blue and there's cool fish and stuff. I don't get the Friends reference. In London, I don't remember that bit. What bit's that from? So what do you reckon? What do we vote in? Nevada? Area 51? It is fun. You get to almost get blown up by a... You launch like a rocket ship or something. Some, some like, you're in the... You buy, you're in the launch pad area and you have to press a button to start the, the blasters and then run and escape before they set you on fire. It's insanely difficult. Um, I don't recall if we get to go on a UFO. I think we do. I just don't remember it all that well. Um, this, that's my problem. It's been so long they all run together. I know. Lara agreed to collect artif artifacts for some rando dude. Sure, that will turn out well. I don't really get Lara's motivation. In the first game, Natla tries to hire her and she's like, look at all this money. And Lara's like, yeah, no, I don't. I don't play for money for sport and then Natla convinces her to take on the job because it's like well I'm gonna send you to Peru and to this place and to that place it's gonna be awesome um and um I don't think it's even mentioned in the second one why she just wants the dagger she just keeps it in a bedside table like what do you even do with these things Lara so when Joey finds out that Monica and Chandler have been sleeping together, they tell him it happened in London, and he shouts, In London! Danny Denny votes for London. Any other votes? Doc, I'm guessing you're going to say London. I want to do London. I want to do London, but I also kind of want to save it. Fuck it. We're doing London. It's decided. We're doing London. <gasps> and she wears that cat suit! She wears that motherfucking cat suit! I mean, Jesus, come on, people. Come on, look at that. Look at that. Oh my god! London. Only shit. Only fucking shit. Why are you not face? Oh. Ooh, what's that pose? Desert Eagle. Fucking killer, look at that. God, I love it. I love it. She's got one eye closed, kinda like she's like she's aiming or something, but also winking. Ain't shit. That was so cool. Doc, you go with London, Warhorse is London, why not? Mm-hmm. It is kind of an execution pose. I mean, I wouldn't mind if that was the last thing I saw. Lara in a cat suit, winking at me with the Desert Eagle in London. Can we ask to go out any other way? Okay. Oh, shit. Look at it. Look at it. Oh, my God. I'm home. It totally doesn't look like this, but I'm home. Not an accurate representation of London, but... It is as far as I'm concerned. I played this game and fell in love with this before I even lived in London. Because I'm not from London originally. Man. Oh, that's so cool. Um, so... Suggested order. Um, they... Recommend choosing Nevada first. Oh. You, okay, so what happens at the beginning of the Nevada level is you get captured and you lose your weapons. 
and you have to reacquire them. If you, you'll never get back the other items that you lost, so you lose all of your, all of your medkits. All of your flares, every, all of this. I don't even have the fucking guns yet. Bullshit. Um, you lose all of the other items you lost, but if you go right from India to Nevada, you'll have more levels to collect new gear before the end of the game. Okay. Well, that puts things in perspective. Um, shit. Well, we're still going to do London first, because fuck it. We'll do London, and then we'll do Nevada, and then we'll do the other one. Um, okay, so we have, on this level, five secrets. Good lord. Secret number one is, again, right out of the gate. Um... Okay, so yeah, that's way. I'm sorry, wait, I'm lost already. I'm like, do what now? And then do a running jump from here. Go. Nope. Boom. It's already so ominous. Goodies. Uh. Holy shit, we're about to go on a crane? Sorry, you want me to do what? Position Lara in the middle of the block. Step off the edge? Just step off the edge? Are you sure? Are you sure about this? Oh, ow, barbed wire, ow. Ah! 
<laughs> now how do we get out of here once we've got the secret? The colouring, the outline, it makes her look like she's not wearing anything. Um, so to get out, out what? The room turn left. What's with barbed wire? Ooh. Climb onto the ledge above, then climb the yellow. Oh, there it is. Yellow grating. I love the sound design. Okay, I need screenshots for this. I'm just trying to follow the the directions and it's like, oh, okay, at this point, I don't know. Um, oh, this way. No! supposed to grab it. You were supposed to grab it, not jump over it. So it's... I was all confident that we would make that. Wilkinson, I'm sorry I missed you coming in. Howdy. Sorry, I was looking at my walkthrough. Um, ba -ba -ba, Lara in a cat suit overlooking the city at night. Big damn hero. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah, she's so fucking cool.
Captain Caffeine, you gotta get some work done. All right, thank you for being here. Well, at least we didn't die that time. Come on, Lara. Oh, Adam, you missed the caves of Kalia, Kalia, however we're saying it. Well, you can go back and watch it later. Cobra pit, I know. We actually did really well. I didn't get um I didn't get poisoned. Which I was quite surprised about. Webster, hello. Yeah, the VOD. Watch the VOD. There we go. There we go. And we're back where we started. All that for the first secret on this level. London time, yes. Yes, and now I know we did read the, the walkthrough um, that advised and, and someone, uh, I forget who it was yesterday, someone said do Nevada first. I'm fully aware that this is not the most strategic plan, but goddamn, I wanted to be in London. I just wanted to do this level. What have you missed, Webster? Um... What haven't you missed? We got done in India. We got eaten by piranhas. Uh, we drove a quad bike. We fell into a pit in the quad bike. Um, but we found some stuff. We got... We got all the secrets. Okay, secret number two. We're looking for climbing through to the back alley with a scaffold. <laughs> Piranhas! Fuck yeah. Um, I would do Nevada then after this, then South Pacific. Yes, that's the plan. That is the plan. So... I don't actually know where we're going. I don't, I remember always being confused by this first, first part of this level. I played probably the London levels more than anything else. Oh, ah, what, what? Who's that? What are you? The pro. Oh, what? Go take a nap. Jesus. Oh. I didn't even get to see what we did with the lever. Ah, uh, we put a door up or something, I think. Um, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I rem- Oh, uh, I remember- I remember messing this up more than I remember how to actually do it. It's the trapdoor, and that allows us- there's a, there's a guy with shotgun or something in there, I remember that. Um, that allows us to get in there, but for some reason... For some reason I have this memory of you're not supposed to pull it straight away. I don't recall. This is the original, by the way. Look at it. Look at it. Let's look at the... Look at the cityscape. So, new. Original. Are you impressed? Are you impressed by London? Doesn't it look pretty? Oh, the moon was in the original! Wait, where's the moon now? What? They took the moon out? They put the moon in the other game and now they're taking out this one? Fuck you, Tomb Raider. You can see my house. Ooh. Um. Oh, I forgot 
thought she can do this. I knew she could do that in this game. The moon is in a different place. What? The sound sometimes, the music is... Oh, I hear something. Make that jump. Is Lara just Spider Man? Basically. Alan, what? You've... <laughs> Your phone has gone leafy? Oh. Um, I glitched that. We can't move. We can do nothing but let go. And fall to our death. Sorry, Lara. You get over there. There we go. graceful she walks gracefully she falls gracefully she still dies though just like the rest of us Clara died in London is that gonna be the theme oh yeah we can't oh, oh we can do that is that going to be the theme of, of this game is I'm like panicking about stuff and you guys are talking about friends scenes? See, he told you there was a guy there. He's getting the shotgun. Oh, he's got a laser. Wait, you got Desert Eagle? Can I have it? Oh, that's not Desert. What is that? Can I have it? Can I have it? Whatever it is, please may I have it. Share? Come on, you don't need it anymore. Ludsgate. Oh, I love Ludsgate. Why will it be so difficult? What do you mean? I feel like I've maybe chosen the wrong order for this. Bloodskate. I don't remember the level, but I remember the name. No wonder I died so much the first time I played it and struggled so hard. If I, because I guaranteed I did London first. I see that collapsy floor and I see that trap door that's probably released with this. But I also saw shotgun shells that I want to pick up. I think we jump over there. Shotgun shells. Underwater maze, huge one. I just remember getting hit by trains a lot. Red lights and green lights still give me a flash of fear.
Oh, we can do this. Maybe we do a jump from down there. By down there, I mean on the right. I've no idea. button just fucked us because that lowered that trapdoor. Why why would we Why would we want to lower that trapdoor again? Mm. Old Witch, yeah. I mean the whole London levels, but yeah, Old Witch. Yep. I really want to go in Old Witch Station. They do occasionally open it up for tours. Oh, we can go down. When in doubt, always go down. Polite thing to do. No, Lara! I said no! Mmm. Alan, you're having a beer and a fat cigar. Well, nice. Melissa, you going to your first appointment? Your daycare kid? Drive in now. All right. going. Hello, Miss Little. Wait. Tralala. We're oh. going to head to Tennessee. Play my dad. Play my dad in Mortal Kombat. Ooh. Tell you what, we are going to need all seventy-seven of these flares for the London levels, for sure. I just worked out why I always think of this game when I play Uncharted 3. It has the same doors. I swear that they just did the research for Uncharted 3 was just playing this level. It's for vacation. Cool. How long are you going to be gone for? Oh, just for the weekend. Oh, we'll have fun. Let's figure out how to get these.
feel like if we can get onto this platform, we might be able to jump diagonally, maybe. I don't know. This feels like a... I was going to say, it feels like a fake out. But if you look in the original, so this is the new vision. Originals like this, you can barely even see that those are there. She can't make them. Not quite. <laughs> oh, I see. I see. I got it. I know what I'm doing. Sweet Alice cookies! So is this game like a maze where you try to find your way around? Not usually. The the third one, it, it kind of is, but most of the time there should be a very obvious way forward. What you need is like a key or something, or you generally, you generally don't get stuck. Certainly Tomb Raider 1 was like that. Tomb Raider 2 got a little more complicated where you would have more of like a larger area and you had to check out different ways, remember what doors you'd seen that were locked, that you then find a key for somewhere else, and so on and so on. Um, however, Tomb Raider 3 <clears throat> decided to kind of the ante a little bit, and uh, yeah, it, got, it just got a little crazy. Is where I want to go? I don't even know what the point of that bit is. But we're in London in a cat suit, so I'm happy. Splinter Cell? What about Splinter Cell? Now I see what this trapdoor is for. It is very, like, um, puzzly in that way of, like, physically figuring out where to go as part of the puzzle. But it's not like um portal or something where you just that is the game is figuring it out shit can convince we can make this uh alan says it's only four weeks today before i get sent to blackpool i mean go to blackpool oh N no we no are we stuck? Can we, can we glitch this way? Can we, can we do it? Bro as well. Bro. Oh, it reminds you of Splinter Cell. Got it. Oh. 
found some sort of some sort of something. Travis, you gotta head out of here. Finish up this day. Yeah, we'll see you tomorrow. Thank you for being here. Use the flag. Oh, are we gonna do that weird glitch thing again? <laughs> the bird is saying, Lara, Lara. She, yeah, we've done the glitch. We've, we've fucked it. If you are crouching and you, there's two different positions. My word, that cat suit is very flattering on her. Good job, Lara. Um, it's obviously tailored. Um, if you're crouching and you're, if you're on all fours, you can't pull out your guns or, or, um, light a flare. But if you tap triangle, she's, she goes into the sort of kneeling crouch position and she's supposed to pull out her guns out, but she didn't. And then I tried to pull a flare out and then it's, it, it craps out. You can't move after that. It's like, where the fuck am I? Now, if there's any going in here. Shit, I meant to actually kill that crow and light flare before I got in here. No. What with the shotgun girl? Pistols, just a crow. Where is it? Crow sounds like it's mocking a dog barking. <laughs> it probably is. We got, I have no idea where we're going. Lara can't crawl, think, listen, get a flare. And pose all at the same time. I mean, I am asking a lot. What the? F oh, this is the the back alley. Remember? Remember the the walk through about getting a secret said something about a back alley. Um. Oh, I think we missed something. We have the flu room key. No. We might be all right. Um. Shoot another crow. Turn for another blah. blah. Hang on, hang on. We go in here first. is a long drop. See rats over there. See a safe crystal down there. What? Where are we going? Use a sword trick. Oh, it doesn't work in this view. I was going to use the guns to light up the room. Oh no, that's that's not something we can climb down. I 
no one else. the rats. Apparently we're jumping this way. Oh my word! There was actually a ledge there! Holy shit! Through the doorway in the corner, shoot the mercenary. Well, I only have one round left. Fuck. That gun into England. Hey, we got a flu room key. That is a trap door. The hand was like positioned over her butt.
Okay, then watch us press a button. You guys see a button anywhere? Um... Button. Ah, okay. It's so much brighter on the original. We're just going to play original mode for now. to grab this. There it is. So that was not a secret. The shotgun shell is the secret. Okay, so right. she got it. It's a secret, secret little traversy thing. Oh, no. Ow. I didn't know crows could be so mean. Oh, God. Oh, what the? No. Oh, we're gonna have to kill those crows. the two of them. So much brighter with the flare. I know. You didn't know crows could be so mean. Have you not played Days Gone? Days Swamp? Never heard of it. Hey, there's the secret.
how did we get in there? Oh yeah, this way. Secret number three, Llama Roberts with his Llama Stay. Just wanted to pop in, hit the like, and say hi. Oh, thank you for popping in. Okay, so ooh, next secret is. Oh, if you miss secret number two, only you can get it now. God damn. Secret number three is not until after we've used the flu room key, I think. Rooftops and entrance to underground industrial area. Super helpful. Crows in real life, real life are assholes too. I watched three crows peck a baby robin to death. As his parents watched. It just left its body, didn't even eat it. They are very territorial. They will... Oh, look, paint. Um, they will absolutely fuck your shit up if you mess with them. Um, they're very smart birds, and they recognize when... Um, ooh, not that way. When they're being threatened. So I have a lot of respect for them. Like crows. Where are we going? Can we make that? Yeah, let's, uh, let's try. And she jumped through this rope. Does this rope exist? Oh, 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 I almost let go of the button. Oh, shit. Oh, shit, she won't move. Ara. We have crows up here, possibly ravens. The fight over the dumpsters. We must have to move this, this platform somehow. Except I don't know how. I don't know where that is. MM! You come in and the first thing you see is Lara falling to a death. Good start. Welcome in. Welcome in. And yeah, we've done a little bit of that. Okay, so that would have been helpful earlier, but... Oh. Mm. Got a flash of something. Uh, I'm actually going to hit the intermission screen just real quick. I'm just going to go top up my coffee. And um, I'll be back in literally, don't go anywhere, we'll be like a minute. Oh, what is it doing? Move! Move! 
Is that going to drop us down? I see a shiny on like a trap door. So going to drop us down in there, isn't it? Yep, knew it. Oh, hi. Now be <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, it ain't me. <laughs> For a second, I was like, this is going to go okay. And then, no. No, 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 no. No, oh, move. Oh, 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 no, 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 no. Oh, what is it doing? Move, move. Get up, Cal. Good idea, says so Dandy Denny. Coffee time. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. I don't know why we had a random gift show up then. That was weird. Um, okay, so what do we Where do we get this out? Um Does this thing have controls? If anyone knows where the hell we're supposed to be going, please do share. I'm happy to take advice from the chat. I mean, I see where we want to be. I understand the end goal. Nylon girl, hello. There's like a little... I think I see it. I don't think it was supposed to be a diagonally jump. Diagonal jump. I think we can just jump straight across. Will it let you climb the ropes? No. Sorry, let me say that as Lara. No. Oh! Good job. Saved it. I thought there was a ledge there. Thought there was a ledge there. Uh, came in a lot like say. Uh, had to go help grandma. She had sinus surgery. Oh yeah, there's no ledge there. Let's see if we can do that jump because I I kind of bluffed this jump earlier. Um, ooh shit. She wouldn't. See, she won't move once we grab it. I'm slightly convinced that's the way we gotta go. <laughs> I walk in and she says, you didn't have to come. Like, shut up, Grandma. Yes, I did. What is it with- oh, hello, Lara. Well, what is it with grandmas? Or maybe we all get like this when we're old, but we're just like, no, you didn't have to bother. Don't worry about it. I'm, okay, I'm looking up the uh, walkthrough. Do we have to go back into the other room? Okay. I don't know where we're going. 
We've got secret number two. Follow to the T section. Painter's scaffold. Press the button. Roll back through the tunnel. Okay, so we're going back into the other room. We didn't need to start fucking around in this room yet. Oh, ow! Ooh, 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 nearly died. You strike through to the opening head, turn around, safety drop down. Oh, they use the word smidgen. I like that word. We've been here. Have we not been here? We've been here. Um, down an alley. Take out the gunman. We did that already. Get the loot. Yada yada yada. No, we got that already.
Wait, the water isn't mentioned fire. What? Okay, hang on. We've taken a wrong turn. mention the fire Okay, we've somehow, this is, this looks different, like it looks the same, until it suddenly looks very different. Looking at the screenshot, so... Yeah. Follow the passageway. It doesn't look like that. Ah, oh, what? Hold on, hold on, hold on. This passageway. My word, this passageway. So what was the other fucking passageway? This level is bonkers. There's a flag. There's a flag. Look at it. There's a flag. Oh. It was there in the original? I don't remember seeing this in the original. You know, this game is making me feel like I've never played it before. I feel like I'm ignoring the chat because I'm too busy looking up the the walkthrough. Um, let's see, how do we? Ooh, how do we get out of here? The alley. The, this game is ridiculously dark. The original was not so much. That's why I keep switching back and forth. When they did their little their update. The, the remaster, they decided to make it stupid dark. <sighs> Hang on, what did I, what did I miss? Um, Nylon girl, your grandma's good, just stubborn, incredibly strong woman. Oh, she got in a car accident a couple of years ago and she's in a wheelchair. The level is very dark. It is. Hopefully soon we will get out of just the the crazy darkness. I don't know if this is where I'm supposed to be going. Oh, 
Easy, Laura. Easy. Easy, love. Oh, look at the moon. There's the moon. Slightly less round than it should be. Um... Every time I try to drink... Paints. Go, what? What? Yeah, drinking... Don't drink paint. You saw some swans flying over? Have you been... Have you been on the paint? They wanted to make it perfect dark. Yeah, they didn't need to do that. Would have been better if they didn't. Let's see. Um, what are we doing? Get the flares. Oh, and use the flu room key to unlock the door. Oh, yeah, okay. This way. Good lord, girl. Now we've raised that scaffolding. Harry? Who said oi? Somebody said oi. Is it the crow? Oh, it's that guy. Oh. Oh, no, 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 no. Shoot the crow, shoot the crow, shoot the crow. So what we were talking about. This must be the flu room key. Or the flu room. We need the flu room key for. That's the somebody's up to no good music. Oh, that's the original. You can't see anything. Let's light a flare. We have 95 flares. Fuck it. Light two. One in each hand. So sure about this. So it feels like a trap. Oh, we don't need the flare anymore. You guys were complaining about it being dark. Well, now it's on fire. Are you happy? Are you happy? Did you get what you wanted? I'm gonna crawl under this. Let's try. Yeah, we can. We can just crawl under the fire. I love it. Oh, no, we can't. Oh, we can't crawl under the one that's by the floor, Lara. And there I was thinking I was being so smart. Oh, we can just crawl under the fire. Mm-hmm. going.
Hold on, what did I miss in the chat? What did I miss in the chat? Um, trying to type with nylon gloves on again. All about that nylon, nylon girl. Uh, Doc, oh, you got to run? Okay, thank you for being here. Oh, wait, that's not Nylon Girl saying that. Sorry, I missed the... I saw Nylon Girl's name, and I assumed that was you, your comment. Wait, who fan was wearing nylon gloves? Rex says, I use them to keep my fingers from getting sticky with cannabis. <laughs> Dandy Danny says, they're useful for everything, from murder to arts and crafts. Nylon is indeed a wonderful material. Many uses. It's kind of an obsession. Um, who fan you use them... To keep from getting skin oil on archival material. Oh shit, that sounds fucking awesome. I love the words archival material. Oh, you've been on the balcony at home, Alan, and you saw some swans flying over. I'm up all over again. Spider Lara, Spider Lara, go! How we're just back to the beginning of the level again. And save. Uh, who found you working with microfilm right now, but also old court records from the 1600s? That's awesome. I want to know more about that. I want to know more about what you do. All right, this is probably a good place to wrap it up. I'm sure we'll start it tomorrow and be like, what? We're at the beginning of the level. I won't remember. Uh, that we've already done a whole fucking bunch of stuff. Um, so, what day is it today? Thursday. Thursday today? Is it really? I'm literally empty. I'm so out of sorts from the last week being out for two days. And then with the time change, I'm totally thrown. And then yesterday, my kiddo having the day off from school. Tomorrow. Oh, shit. The snow is now like that. It is snowing fucking hard. So tomorrow's going to be a snow day. Definitely. Um, but yeah, let's see. We won't be back with Tomb Raider until Monday. Monday next week. Next week is going to be our last four days of doing Tomb Raider. So I don't know how much we're going to get through. I, I may play a little over the weekend and just like <laughs> bang out some of these secrets. Um, we'll see. We'll see. Who fans says I'm jealous? I want snow. Well, come hang out. Come hang out. In fact, come hang out at Days Gone Calm. Uh, let me drop this link in the chat. Days Gone Calm. Uh, if you want to come to Denver, Colorado, come see the snow. Snow not guaranteed. Um, April 26th through the 28th. This year, so in a month, just over a month, uh, we are doing an in real life get together. Me, Spawnicus Rex, some other awesome members of this community is going to be fucking killer. Get your ass here. You're invited. Come hang out. Everyone is invited. $15 via PayPal, todaysgonepod at gmail.com. Um, we just locked in some details on the itinerary. If you already have a ticket, uh, check your email or the Discord, uh, the private chat on the Discord. And I posted some ideas just the other day. Warhorse, I know you got back to me. Cap, you also threw in a vote. We have three options for our Saturday afternoon group outing. Uh, so I just want to kind of get ideas from people which one they prefer. Um, 
we've had a couple votes for the same thing so far so I'm, uh, that one's in the lead but yeah if you're coming check out the the check your email or check the discord chat and let me know uh which one you want to vote for and uh we'll figure it out from there so that's in april but tomorrow we'll be back streaming tomorrow afternoon 1 p.m so just over 24 hours from now 1 p.m mountain time um it will probably still be snowing and i'll let you know how much snow we have for a lot of snow uh we will be playing dishonored 2 that's tomorrow afternoon dishonored 2 and then we'll be back around to tomb raider 3 on monday at 8 a.m mountain the usual time um Hubert says bye. Nylon Girl says as of right now, tomorrow's my last day before I'm laid off for two weeks. Could change tomorrow. Um, kind of looking forward to the break. Oh, nice, yeah. Yeah, nice lot. Two weeks. Is it like furloughed? Like they just don't need you for two weeks? Because that kind of sucks. But also two week break. I know you don't enjoy your job. Or or you don't enjoy the location or the management or something. So that'll be that'll be nice. Uh, yeah, come to Colorado. We've got lots of snow. Dandy Denny, you want me to send you some? All right, I'll put some in the mail. <laughs> um, there will be still, there'll still be snow on Pikes Peak for sure. And a lot of the mountains, the Rockies will still have lots of snow in April. It was very snowy on Pikes Peak last year. Yeah. Okay, uh, let me drop the usual links in here. If you want to help this channel continue, help this channel grow, you know what to do. Here's the link, here's all the info in the chat. You can either do a one-time contribution or become a channel member. Membership is really where it's at, so you get perks and rewards in return for your money, as well as helping the channel. So please do consider if you're not already a member or if you just want to throw some money in that tip jar, that's all the info, how to do it right there. Um, if you want to check out my wish list, gift something to the channel, uh, you can go to throne.com slash 8 There it is in the chat. And also, you can gift yourself something, get yourself some merch. BetterUpTavern.threadless.com. That is where it is at. Okay, so yeah, I'll be back tomorrow. Usual, well, not the usual time, the usual Friday time. 1 p.m. Mountain um, with Dishonored 2. Have a great day, everyone. Enjoy the weather wherever you are at. Whether it's 80 degrees or 20. Stay safe. Have fun. Um, and I will see you all next time. Bye.